Facebook is dealing with a growing threat from some members of Congress who say they want to break up the company. CEO Mark Zuckerberg testified at a House committee hearing in Washington yesterday. Democrats hit him with a barrage of criticism on election security and other topics. Ed O'Keefe is on Capitol Hill. Ed, what brought Zuckerberg to Congress this time? Well, good morning, Anthony. He was officially here to talk about his new ideas for cryptocurrency, but lawmakers spent more time asking about other subjects, including civil rights and political advertising on Facebook ahead of the 2020 elections. We faced a lot of issues over the past few years. Officially called to testify about his ideas for a new cryptocurrency, lawmakers pressed Mark Zuckerberg on a variety of topics, like concerns about diversity at Facebook. You have ruined the lives of many people, discriminated against them. And whether the company is doing enough to root out sex traffickers. We're working with law enforcement and building technical systems to identify well, you're not working hard to, hard enough sir but it was facebook's plan to continue running ads from political candidates even if they're misleading that earned special interest it seems that a policy that allows politicians to lie mislead and deceive would also allow facebook to sell more ads to those politicians thus making your company more money the very small percent of our business that is made up of political ads does not come anywhere close to justifying the controversy that this incurs. New York Congresswoman Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez asked Zuckerberg whether she'd be able to buy ads with false information about her liberal environmental plan. Do you see a potential problem here with a complete lack of fact-checking on political advertisements? Well, Congresswoman, I think lying is bad, and I think if you were to run an ad that had a lie, that would be bad. So you won't take down lies, or you will take down lies? I think it's just a pretty simple yes or no. In a democracy, okay. I believe that people should be able to see for themselves what politicians that they may or may not vote for so are you saying won't take judge them their down. character for themselves. Some Republican lawmakers refrained from attacks and praised his ideas, comparing Zuckerberg to the president. You're both very successful businessmen. You're both capitalists. You're both billionaires. You've both challenged the status quo. He calls it draining the swamp. You see it as innovation. As if a rough day with lawmakers and talk about possibly breaking up Facebook wasn't enough, now 47 state attorneys general say they're working together on a new antitrust investigation of Facebook that comes as some federal agencies are also conducting antitrust investigations. Gail? All right, Ed O'Keefe, very interesting day on Capitol Hill. Thank you very much.